Alright, what's going on everyone? It's Picky Choco. So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about three different topics as the new character Tommy. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Probably Tuma has been leaked. And honestly, it's kind of weird to say leaked because it's been going on since the Ayaka renders and he was even mentioned in one of the character conversations. So now he has popped up recently with some strong confirmations. And we're also gonna be covering about the Chasm update and the possible characters rolling along with it so make sure to watch and we're also covering the 1.7 leaked sort of character banners and the reason behind this huge jump with all the five and the four stars so let's get into it right now but before we do just want to say if you're not subscribed to my channel and you do watch it please subscribe as it will help me a lot motivates me and shows me that you guys like these videos all right now we're done with that talking now let's get into the actual main thing that y'all are here for so we're gonna be talking about the 1.7 five star characters lineup because it'll be much clearer as it's getting very much confused but don't worry okay so here we go boom so the five stars that we might see in 1.7 banners are ayaka and yoi mia now it's a sudden jump from all the rerun speculations to these characters being close to confirm straight in the 1.7 so now to understand this let's give a little bit summary over this new update so recently in the CN community it's being a bit of a hustle tussle between the members and Mahoyo so what the members think is reruns might be conducted later but right now people are so much wanting to go into Inazuma as they want to see new things and new sort of content and honestly the sort of hype that's been around Inazuma and Ayaka since the day one of the release of the game so I'll just pop off a screenshot so it makes kind of sense what I'm talking about so it's from a very very trusted and reputed member of the Genshin community. So as per his tweets a few days ago, he said that Ayaka and Yoimiya are a guarantee and will definitely be coming after Kazuha which will be 1.7. So now that sums up and makes some sense. Now as for Yoimiya, people are very much excited as she's been in a shadow for too long. I mean there's not even single detail revealed apart from some claims that saw her 3D model being deleted. We don't know much about her. As for now, we only have an idea that she's a pyro bow user who is from Inazuma. So Ayaka and Yoimiya pretty much confirmed for 1.7 5 star banners. The order is unknown but as soon as new info pops up, I'll make a video on that. Now moving on to the newest 4 star character who might be in 1.7 banner is Toma or Toma or whatever you call it. Obviously, we all know Lumi Lumi, a very good and trusted person in the Genshin community. I won't actually share the screenshot here because of the copyright reasons but I'll link it in the description so you get the picture idea so he tweeted that a few days ago so as far as Tuma goes the reason of him being a four star and not a five star is he resembles his attacks similar to Hu Tao at least that's been popping around for now and he's a pyro polearm user so that kind of makes sense and I don't know if it's confirmed but Toma is actually closely related to Ayaka so that's gonna be pretty interesting to watch so that's all about the characters lineup of course Mahoyo might change it anytime but as for now I believe this might be true now moving on to another region that everybody is waiting for so long so about the chasm a new update has popped up by uncles another trusted member of the CN Genshin community so I'm gonna pop a screenshot he shared a few hours ago and it states that chasm will be at the end of November along with Baizu and Yao Yao being the playable characters so it's the info that we know at the latest so as far we know about Baizu he's a dendro catalyst so if this speculation is true so it's kind of close around probably a few months or so of course Mahoyo might change them any minute and if any update pops around I'll be sure to make a video on that and yeah so that's basically it for the video so just thought I'd update y'all on new news about Toma, Ayaka, Yoimiya and of course the chasm region that's having Baizu and Yao Yao which everyone is excited about so I hope this video was helpful to you and I hope you're excited for Klee and Kazuha as well as the new Inazuma because it might pop up soon so make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any type of these videos as well as fun videos so many interesting things lined up i'll be looking forward to it so i'll catch you all in the next video until then stay safe and stay picky